Well, hello everybody. This is Three Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're gonna to talk about Justin Swanson selling his new 1969 Nova build. Now, for the goes directly to Justin Swanson, please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Three Outlaws No Prep Games race series and all the other Three Outlaws shows. So, as we all know, Justin Swanson was building this 1969 Nova. Cameron Johnson Racecourse was building it, and they were actually making pretty good progress on it. He wasn't set to run this car this year on NPK. He was going to run prenup again, and I think that was the best decision because prenup was very fast last season, and they changed a little bit on the setup for this year. They learned a lot, and prenup is going to be faster this season and possibly make a run for the championship. Because that car is capable of winning the championship. It almost wins it last season. But obviously, Ryan Martin put the brakes on that. And Ryan won it. Fair and square. Now, Justin recently published on his Facebook page that he sold the 1969 Nova. Now, this car was not finished. But he had, I believe, all the parts for it. And the chassis was well underway of being done. So, now it has a new owner. He is concentrating on running prenup. The Lexus that he ran last season as well. I believe that is the best move. And a lot of people don't understand how expensive it is to build one of these cars. And not only that, but how hard it is to run the No Prep Kings seasons. I mean... It's 15 races, traveling, expenses, spare parts. If you break something, it's extremely expensive. These cars, engines, transmissions are very, very expensive. You also need spare motors, spare transmission, spare converters. So it takes a lot of money to run one of these cars on NPK. You might have a car, but running the whole season and running for the championship is extremely expensive. And unless you're winning, like Ryan or even Justin or some of the other guys that actually have won a couple of these races that pay 40000 to win or Team Attack that pays $15,000 to win, it is very tough. And I believe Justin needed to put all his money into running this season's NPK series. He won a couple of races last year. I believe he is going to win again this year as well. And only focus on one car, not on multiple cars. He's had a lot of different cars throughout the years, but NPK, I believe, is the toughest racing format he has raced in. So he's staying with prenup. He might build a car later down the road, but for now, prenup is going to run NPK.